this foundation hack is supposed to solve all your foundation problems like welcome back to my channel if you're new here a very warm welcome if you are a regular thank you very much for stopping by once again and if you are just passing by and came across this video and decided to watch it thank you very much for watching i hope you stay i hope you decide to subscribe to comment to like like the rest of the family here i'm Tsuluko Ushu and on today's video we're trying out a tiktok foundation hack right so i tried to shoot this video last year but then i didn't like some of the clips on the video i tried to edit it and i was like nah it's not working out <laughs> so i decided to try it again i even saw other youtubers trying it out and i was like i'm going to plug my beauty bunnies with this foundation hack so this foundation hack is supposed to solve all your foundation problems like it's supposed to assist the makeup to stay for long or for as many hours as possible it's also supposed to assist in making sure that your face doesn't look shiny when you start to sweat it's also supposed to make sure that your foundation doesn't flake all the problems that you experience when you wear makeup for a long time but before we do that i think we have to try it out so that we know if it works or if it's true what they're saying about it or not so, so let's start with our video hi Vanice. so the first step of this video is to moisturize so i'm going to be using this moisturizing cream to moisturize my face if you can see it oh where's my mirror oh here yeah. just gonna apply it all over my face and just moisturize After moisturizing, you are moving to the second step, which is um, applying the translucent loose powder. I'm going to use the Yardley translucent loose powder. This is the one that I'm going to be using as always. So I'm going to use this um, foundation brush to apply the, the loose powder all over my face. I don't want to put too much of it. I think we're not supposed to put too much of it. Because on the TikTok video that I was watching, they said you just put just enough. We're going to move to our next step, which is applying the, the setting spray. So I'm going to use the Maybelline's New Lasting Fix. This one this is the first time i'm actually using the setting spray i usually use the fix and go if you've watched my previous videos you will see that i usually use the insta fix and go <laughs> i know i know well i like applying a lot of setting spray because I want my makeup to last for long so setting spray is my best friend then from there you have to wait for the setting spray to dry up but I'm gonna use this to dry it up quickly yeah I think we are good to go um, yeah, I think the setting spray has dried up. So from here, I'm going to apply the the primer. I'm using the Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. This primer. I've been using it ever since I started doing makeup. This has been my favorite primer, but maybe it's high time I tried other primers. So we're gonna apply this primer all over our faces right
Oh guys, I already did my eyebrows off camera to save time. You know they are time consuming. So because today we are only focusing on this um, new foundation routine or the foundation hack, I decided I'm not going to do my eyebrows on camera. So from so. here, I'm going to apply the foundation, my favorite, the one that I always apply, which is the Maybelline's 24 hour super stay full coverage the full coverage so as always i'm gonna put some at the back of my hand so you can see and then i'm gonna take that foundation brush and then take the back of it <laughs> i'm learning new things every day this is one of the things that i learned that it's uh, very effective to do it like this then i'm just gonna Did it like this on my skin before I blend it out just to make sure that every area has a bit of foundation you know what they say big big nightmare from here I'm just gonna blend it onto my skin I think we're coming all right. I'm just making sure there's no, um, like a line that shows that there's foundation here and there's no foundation here because I'm not going to be applying any on my neck. I'm going to be wearing um, something that is a collar. I think it's okay. So let's move to the forehead. I think hmm, you need a bit more on the forehead. I don't know what you guys think, but I feel like hmm, it's well blended and it doesn't look like it's flaking from my side yet. I'm just gonna finish my makeup. And then from there, I'm gonna, yeah, let me finish my makeup and then I'll be back now. Okay, guys, I am done doing my makeup and I'm ready to go run my errand while we test our makeup routine or our foundation hack to see if I'm gonna, I'm not gonna be flaking, if I'm not gonna be shiny or if this makeup is gonna stay longer than it usually does when I'm wearing makeup. So yeah, just stick around and accompany me while I run my errands and then we'll drop the car in fry bag and then I'm gonna call come back home. So yeah. Hi guys, it's 9.30 in the morning, 9.30 a.m. And I'm about to leave. I'm going to town and then yeah, we'll check again around 10.30 how the makeup looks. And this is how it's looking right now. And I feel like we're slaying honey. <laughs> I just arrived at town. I'm about to buy a few things and the makeup is still like this. Hopefully it's still popping and mattified. You won't believe this. I'm only about to drive to Freiburg now. It's quarter past two in the afternoon and I'm only about to drive now. I thought by now I'd be long gone, but then we had a meeting and it took longer than expected. So I had to wait until the meeting was over before I could leave. Anyway, now I'm waiting for Gaya to finish so that we can leave. But as you can see, our foundation is still intact. I'd like to think it's still intact. So yeah. We just arrived in Freiburg and now it's half past four in the afternoon and 
this is how the foundation is looking like or this is how my, my makeup is looking like currently it's a bit shiny um which is not something we expected because we had high expectations right so i'm just gonna do what i'm here to do and then i'm just gonna be heading back home so i'll see you guys when we get home hi guys um i just got back from Freiburg, and this is how our makeup is looking like it did not flake well it did hold up for Jeez. let's see 9 10 11 12 one two three four seven hours later yeah yeah i can i can give it that it really did the job it did what it needed to do and after um, i got to fry back, things got so hectic and i couldn't vlog anything i was just you know consumed by this and that and i couldn't you know vlog and update you guys each and every hour is promised but this is how the makeup is looking like right now it's half past nine in the evening it's not bad though it's not bad i think i don't think this routine is it's bad it does the job it does what it you know supposed to do 80 percent of the job is done just that now i look a bit shiny because you know i've been going up and down or maybe it's because i naturally have an oily skin out of 10 i can give it eight because my foundation on my face was mattified most of the day and it can help your makeup to stay intact for seven or eight hours let's just you know put it like that because i have an oily skin i don't know with other people maybe it will last longer but for me it only worked for seven hours which is good very good actually so we can just say this routine really does work if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you have a question or a suggestion please leave it in the comment section and if you have not subscribed to my channel please do subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that you get notified next time i upload another fire video and until next time mwah, mwah, mwah.